If you're an hourly employee and you clock out, but then you have to keep working, the question is, should you be paid for that time? My name is Adam Ganelli and I'm an employment rights attorney. And the answer to that question is an unequivocal yes. Having to work off the clock like that is one of the most egregious examples of what we call wage theft. We see this a lot in the fast food industry, in the financial industry, in the healthcare industry, in the retail industry. Sometimes what happens is employees have to start working before they clock in. Most of the time, what happens is employees clock out and then they're made to keep working. For example, in the fast food industry, what might happen is you're told to wait to clock in until your first customer shows up, even though your shift started a half an hour earlier. In the financial industry, maybe you work at a bank and you're told to clock out, but then you still have to do some paperwork. In the healthcare industry, we oftentimes see nurses who are supposed to get an unpaid lunch break, but because of the nature of the job, they have to work straight through without getting paid. And especially we see this in the retail industry, where a lot of hourly workers are made to clock out and then go back to work, stocking shelves and cleaning up and so forth. And essentially what's happening is your employer is stealing time from you. Let's flip that around and take the opposite scenario. Let's say you're a dishonest employee and you lie about the hours you worked. You record that you worked 10 hours when in fact you only worked eight. Well, you'd probably be fired if you were caught. You might even be accused of fraud. But for some reason, when the opposite happens, when you work eight hours but you're only paid for six, there seems to be a lot less concern. And that's wrong. Under the law, you're entitled to be paid for all the hours you worked. If you think this applies to you, and you've been forced to work off the clock, what I want you to do is pick up the phone and give us a call. We deal with these issues every day. My name is Adam Ganelli and I'm an employment attorney. And thanks for watching.